Hello friends. Um today I'm going to be making mela soup in a different way. You know, I have different way of making mela soup, but I'm going to use this delicious way. So, happy viewing. And those are the ingredients. We have the melo, the bonnet pepper, we have uh, thyme, curry and uh, ginger, then bitter leaf, crayfish, onion, um, tomatoes in the can and I'm going to start by boiling my, my meat. Here I have bomo, fresh fish, stockfish and meat. So that is my curry powder, my ginger powder and my uh, thyme. I'm adding my onions. That is curry powder. The first one I added was turmeric, sorry. So now that is to curry and that's my two maggi, no cube. A bit of salt. Don't think the salt is too much. It's not too much. <laughs> and a bit of water. So I'm going to cook that for about 10 minutes. So I'm going to uh, grab my melo. So let me go. I'll pour it in that bowl. And I'll add a bit of water just to soak it up. Going to leave that to soak and here i have my, my tomatoes in the corn that's made with uh, onions and garlic so i have them there my onions bought pepper my onions and cold fish i need to blend them up and i added a little bit of water and here we go so i'm going to check the meat and see if so yeah that's 10 minutes and it's already half Cooked. So I'm going to fry my pepper by adding red oil. I'm going to add my blended pepper. I'm going to leave that to fry for about 10 to 12 minutes. But we need to take out all those excess water that's there. And see, here we go. It's going to look like this. It's going to look like this when it's uh, fried properly. Yeah, we have to dry it up. You can see. All the excess water is dried up into look exactly like this. So I'm going to add my meal. Just adding it in little by little. Just to spread it all up. So I'm just going to mix it very well until everything is mixed properly. But there are different ways of making this uh, egusi soup, melo soup, as I said earlier. So this way is one of my way. So see. It's mixed up properly so it will look like this when it's mixed up properly. Um, uh, I 
just I will so I always uh, stir it every two minutes because you don't want it to stick to the pot. So you can see how it looks like so I fried it for about uh, five minutes and it look like that. So I think it's ready. So I'm going to pour my my boiled meat in it now. So those are my boiled meat. I'm going to pour them in. And I'm going to mix that properly. See, it's going to look like this. Beautiful. Yeah. Just roasting it. Adding more a bit of water. So I'm going to add my bitter leaf now. It's washed already. You can add any vegetable leaf of your choice. I'm adding this the second time I'm adding that now. I'm just going to stir it properly. I'm going to add the no, I'm going to stir it properly. I'm going to leave it for about about five minutes just to uh, soften the bitter leaves. So it's all mixed properly, so I'm going to leave it for about five minutes. So five minutes is up. So here we go. See how it looks like. It's all ready. Cooked. It's done. It's so delicious guys. Go and try this out. Simple way. It's lovely. Maybe in my other video I'm going to show you a different way of making melo soup. Okay? So this is really really lovely guys. Go and try it out. Thank you guys for watching. And if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. And if you have subscribed, thank you. God bless you. Look, I'm giving it